All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today's not a great day. We're gonna talk briefly about what not to do when you make a mold, because this mold was going very good until it wasn't. And I don't know if you guys can tell where things went wrong by looking in the videos. There's my plug in there. And things were going good until I came to the realization that I can't get my plug out. So originally the plan was I was going to have the parts and plug come out like this way, pull out, and I would lay the material in here, vacuum bag it from here, and things would be good. And then I put these caps on because there is a uh, plug kind of wraps around on a 90 degree angle there. And now it's basically a waste of material. So we're gonna go over that in a minute, but first we need to get the plug out before we build things the way they need to be done. And we're gonna do this. I wasn't gonna post this, but you know, it's good for people can learn from my mistakes, I can learn from my mistakes, and uh, saves you some time and effort on what not to do. So let's get this thing apart and uh, start over. Okay guys, it's the next day. I'm going to uh, take this to the car wash, wash all this PVA off it, hit it with some acetone, reprep it, but uh, there was a few things wrong. So originally if it was sitting like this, this is the plug, it was 3D printed by my friend. So the plan was to essentially, if it covered this way, we were going to roll it out this way, which was all good and fine. And the prep work was really good, it just popped right out in some spots, but the big issue was this 90 degree angle we put on here. And once it was covered in fiberglass from end to end, there was just no turning back. So I'm gonna redesign it. Uh, I think I'm gonna come up 90 degrees this way, 90 degrees this way. And it's gonna be laying like this in the mold. So this way and this way, and then a guy can pry that way and pop it out. That's my plan anyway. All right guys, I wanna say thanks for watching. Uh, that's how you don't make a carbon fiber mold. Don't make the mistakes I did. I did prep it good, the prep was good. This is sanded to 1000 grit. It's not polished, it's just sanded to 1000 grit just so there's not too much bite. Uh, I hit it with some PVA. Uh, I had some mold release agent on there and our uh, wax. And it did, it popped out relatively easy in some spots. A couple areas was a little tricky around these little openings we put on here for cooling. But overall, it did, uh, it did come out relatively easy. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching. You guys keep tuned, there's gonna be more come and uh, I apparently have a bunch of work ahead of me here. <laughs> 